Right, that's the state of the car. It's a block of ice. Uh, we shall be walking today, Bear. We are walking on ice. <laughs> Could have put it in the bin, couldn't they? Stop. It's very, very cold. <laughs> I don't have much of an eye for artwork, but is that something Christmassy? That looks sort of like a candle, that one. And that looks sort of like a Santa sleigh. Maybe ish. But uh, that's what it looks like. Right. Did I miss one there? Have you done one? I hope not. I'll be getting in trouble. Oh, crikey, you almost went on the flipping ice there. Right, we shall stay on the mud as we pass the mug tree. Actually, it is cracked on the bottom by the look of it. That was a funny greeting. That was a funny greeting. Go on. Go, boy. Yeah, let's circumnavigate the ice here. Close, bear. You've not emptied the rubbish from here. Close, bear. Close. Go on. Okay, I've left my mark. <laughs> it is chilly. A lot of frost. It's going to be a bit treacherous going down here, I expect, Bear. You will have to wait for me. I should be going very slowly. A lot of these uh, steps going down here are really quite treacherous now. They've just worn away. <clears throat> Somebody was mentioning that yesterday. I'm not sure what he said. I didn't quite hear what he said, whether or not they're actually... Oh, talking about repairing them, or if he was just being hopeful of that. I mean, this this one here, it's just eroded away completely. There is no step there anymore. And similar down a bit further there. It is really quite treacherous coming down here now. Just wait there. Or treacherous for an old wobbly guy, anyway. Bit of mist rising off the water here, look. It is so much calmer than yesterday. It's uh, like a mill pond in the cove here. A little bit of movement further out, but not much. A lot, uh, a lot calmer than yesterday. And it's very frosty looking in this direction. It's not like the rock pools. There's actually ice on that one. That must be uh, rainwater mostly then. I'm a little bit cautious about where I'm stepping here. Yeah, I'm not going to keep on looking in there, <laughs> and I'm not. I'm sure they will not survive there. And uh, people will start messing with them as well, won't they? Looks like there's extra rocks in there on top of some of them there now. Oh dear. Right. Oh crikey. It is very icy here, mate. Uh, right. Tide is still coming in. We are just sitting, definitely not swimming you in this. Too cold for that, mate. Too cold for that. I'm just going to sit here for a bit. Oh, oh! Look at the look at the mist rising here. This is rather atmospheric, is it not? Hmm. <clears throat> uh, just sit for a bit, mate. We're just sitting for a bit. Don't want to get you soaking wet, mate. Too cold for that. It would be turning to ice on you. He's getting comms in my ear there from one of the tenders from one of the cruise ships. No idea which one. But uh, 
they, they ended their conversation with uh, FYI, the chain is over the bulb. Yeah, we know what that looks like, don't we? We've seen that. The chain over the bulb. I think I know what that means. Okay, enough of the enough of the the drift the gently drifting mist there. Hard to do uh, that scene justice really. Isn't that rather cold on your feet there, Bear? Oh, so fascinating over there. <laughs> He's just pleasing himself there, eh? just having a sniff about it. Pleasing himself. I suppose it is true to say that the water temperature will be warmer than the air temperature here right now. Okay, we're done with the misty beach and the frosty beach. It's very frosty here behind us. Uh, we're going to do the woods in the hope that the frost has made the mud a bit firmer. Shot, quick shot of the frosty seaweed. Frosty seaweed. <laughs> I don't know why I had to get a quick shot of that, but uh, you don't often see frosty seaweed here, do you? And according to the news last night, less and less with global warming if worst case scenarios come to fruition, which I'm sure they will. A little bit of ice here. A little bit of ice, which, considering it's probably largely seawater, is uh, not doing too bad. Yeah, the mud is just a little bit firmer. We like that. Morning. Morning. You caught me in the act. Ah, well. <laughs> Somebody always does say, don't they? They 
Sneak out the room. <laughs> yeah, I had to, I had to swing by the uh, lime kiln. Swing yeah. by the lime kiln. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Yeah, all right, all right, we're going up, we're going up. Oh. Yeah, wait for me, mate. It's a bit slippy here, to say the least. Oh. Oh. We made it. Just sit for a bit, mate. Let's just sit for a bit. Oh, good boy. Oh. Oh. Yeah, shush, shush, shush. Go and find a stick. Go and find a stick. There's one over there. You can't find one, okay. Just sit for a bit, mate. I need to recover from having cleaned up here. Actually, for completeness, now let's go back down here, mate. Back down here. It's going to be a bit of a slippy, slidey climb down here, actually. I feel myself falling over. It's going to happen sooner or later. Well, for completeness. For completeness, I need to uh, <laughs> I need to do a bit of footage from out on the swing, don't I? We've done everything else. You just wait there, Burr. Just wait, mate. It's going to be very difficult to do this one-handed on the slope here. It's going to be very difficult. I don't know quite how this is going to work. Okay, we are astroid the log ish. And that is us swinging. Oh, it didn't. Uh, well, that was pretty pointless, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, pretty pointless. I'll break my neck now getting off it. Oh, I managed it. Yeah, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Yeah, I've returned from. <laughs> <laughs> I've returned. Just wait, bro. Let's get me a breath. Let's just hang around here for a second. <laughs> <laughs>